This eagle was a special patient to a lot of us. Um, they are just majestic creatures. This adult male bald eagle came to the Wisconsin Humane Society after apparently being shot out of the sky. He was originally brought to us by a DNR warden last Wednesday after suffering substantial injuries. A busted wing and a cracked beak were the telltale signs of a gunshot wound. For five days, the team at the Humane Society and Blue Pearl Pet Hospital tried to save the bird. It survived an initial surgery, but died Monday night following a second surgery. The staff did everything they could to try to save him, including CPR, for a really long time, but unfortunately he could not be resuscitated. This wooded area in Franklin is where the eagle was found last week on the ground, but that doesn't mean this is where the shot was fired. Wildlife officials say there's no way of knowing how far the eagle may have flown before it fell to the ground. It's a federal crime to shoot a bald eagle and can result in a $100,000 fine and up to a year in prison. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service and the Wisconsin DNR are asking for the public's help, urging anyone with information about the shooting to contact the DNR's violations hotline. Due to this being a federal crime, the DNR does take the carcass's evidence into a federal crime lab. The Humane Society is providing investigators with information and medical records as they deal with the loss that's left the staff a bit shaken. We're all a little bit heartbroken here today. This particular death has, has hit us all a little bit harder. In Milwaukee, I'm Ken Wainscott, WISN 12 News. Anyone with information can contact the DNR violations hotline. The number is on your screen and on WISN.com. Earlier this year, the DNR also investigated bald eagles being shot and killed in Ozaki and Racine counties. Both of those investigations remain open.